to episode four, where um, we are going to choose between going to the shooting gallery or to the castle. And let's start with the castle because it's like story stuff. And then we'll get to the side game thing later. Hyrule Castle. Yeah. Hey, Sparrow. This way. The princess is inside the castle, just ahead. Be careful not to get caught by the guards. <laughs> On this ground, time flows normally. But time stands still while you are in Lon Lon Ranch or in a town. If you want time to pass normally, you'll need to leave town. Well, well, which way are you going to go now? <laughs> do you want to hear what I said again? No, I'm good. Oh, you're a smart kid. Good luck then. <laughs> Toodles. I don't know why you are helping me. I cannot explain your presence. Uh, well, this looks optimistic. Or, this looks promising. Makes me feel optimistic. Hey. So you say you want to see Princess Zelda, eh? You probably heard about her in town and decided you had to meet her. Well, go home! Get out of here. A princess would never grant audience to the likes of you. Well then. That's, that's the perfectly logical thing to say as a guard to a giant stone gate. But... Sh shut up. What the hell? Uh... Oh, it's a... Yeah, I thought it was. Yay! Damn it! Phone call. Uh, gonna have to edit that out. Yay, we got the golden thing. Oh, look! Fantastic. Oh, way up. Uh, okay then. Alright, it's very, very picky. There we go. Hey, the skybox moves. Nice touch. Yeah, crack security system, guys. What's down here? I don't know. Let's save it and find out. No, it's not. Oh, crap. door I probably shouldn't open. Let's go back up here. Pretty sure there's a guard on the other side of that door. Oh yeah, time passes normally here. What do you want, Abby? I can see you're trying to tell me something. What is it, Navi? What is it? What is it? Uh, well, that was odd. Let's continue. Oop, walking into a wall. How sophisticated. Looking just fantastic doing all this. Wiping my nose, making no sense, failing at the commentary. Okay. Oh, yes, to continue my rant that I kind of finished incoherently. I was talking about nostalgic gaming versus retro gaming. And basically, nostalgic gaming is when you let your good memories of something distort your perception of the quality of the work. Hey, you, stop, you kid, over there. Okay. Oh, well, we figured out what the answer isn't. Keep going. 
And I would say retro gaming is kind of what I'm a... Who the f... How the fuck did you get here? I don't know what voice I gave you. Are you going to the castle, fairy boy? Would you mind finding my dad? He must have fallen asleep somewhere around the castle. What a thing for an adult to do. <laughs> oh yeah. If you look for him, I'll give this to you. It's been incubating, or I've been incubating this egg very carefully. I get to touch her egg. You got a weird egg. Feels like there's something moving inside. Set it to see and see what happens on the select item sunscreen. Okay then. Yeah, I, you don't have to tell me how to equip and use items every single time I get an item. It's not, not necessary. Um, your day. Sure, let's save it. Let's do both of the saves. Are you seeing that? Can I try to, like... No. Oh, no. No. Oh, I can't just learn it using my musician skills. Fine. Eh. Get... There you go. If you say so, I'll wait to learn the song. Look, a chicken hatched from the egg you were incubating. It's the miracle of life. Ba -ba -da 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 -da. It looks like this item doesn't work here. It's a chicken. Where does it work? It has no job. I repeat. It is but a chicken. Okay, so let's try going this way. Link, Master of Stone. Dead end. Oh yeah, and then you have to go... <gasps> this is not a linear game. I can go off the path. Screw you adults, tell me what to do, I'll show you. And I'll run across the dirt path. Ah, 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 ah. You won't see me. Because I'm wearing green, I am camouflaged. Ah, I am master of this. Oh my gosh, of this territory. Oh yeah, now I need to sneak through the river. <laughs> some money just for swimming around. That's, that's not what you're supposed to do. Um, here you go. Yeah! And... Yeah! Stuff. Yeah! Take that, Assassin's Creed and Thief. All of that other stuff. Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Mumble 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 Oh hey, my ranch is so fun. Come on, look around. Chicken! What in tarnation? Can't a person get a little shut out around here? Hello. Hello, who might you be? Yup, I'm Talon. Owner of Mon Mon Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver some milk, but I sat down here to rest and think. I guess I fell asleep. Mm hmm. And along was waiting for me, looking for me, and just asking, fuck, I gotta go. Um, uh, I think I left her alone for like three whole days or something. Ah, <laughs> my wife's gonna kill me. <sighs> Okay. 
Link is as nonplussed as ever. It's like, alright. Some kind of wacky bullshit, I don't care. I just am happy to have found a use for the chicken. And if you're wondering how far I have gotten in this game, um, we are nearing it. It's like a cutscene or two ahead, and then I don't know what to do. And we'll figure it out together. Oh no, I actually have, have visited the Roly Poly Rock people. What do they call them? Gorgons? Something like that. I've gotten there before, but I don't know that I've beaten or like finished that territory. I don't think I have gotten very far in this game. In total. Oh wait, is this what I'm supposed to be doing? Uh, yeah, isn't it? Well, let's let's just hope it is. Grab, grab, and push. Grab and push. Do what your friend taught you back in Kokiri with the rock. You know, you know the rock. That rock that gets around. Right out in the open, in front of everybody, even. That boy. He's encouraging. Uh, I think that means I didn't screw it up. So let's save it. And jump! Yeah. Enter. I'm sneaking up Zelda's back door. Castle Courtyard. Oh, you don't see me. I am master of hiding. <laughs> you still don't see me, right? nearsighted guards in video game history, I would venture to say. Um, uh, I can't see myself. Oh my gosh! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> God damn it! Hey, you. <laughs> what the fuck was that? That was... <laughs> Seriously, now. I had no idea where I was, what I was on, like, standing on. And then suddenly, I can... Have at you! <laughs> Jump out of nowhere, trying to ambush the guards. Next time, consult me, Link. Next time you think up a plan like that, ask me if you think it's a good idea. No. Climb it. Pull. Get. Get up. Get up it and climb it. Climb. climb scale. Traverse obstacle. Shot web, mother... Oh, okay. I don't... Some... Oh, damn it. Uh, why is it always more difficult the second time in this game? Okay, that doesn't work. Do the... Do the... Yeah! Damn it. Oh, there was climb for a split moment. I remember hating the, like, the use key. Uh, oh, maybe there's no way to get past those guards at first. They're, they're, they're just there to teach you about getting sent back. Or maybe it's just harder at nighttime or something. I don't know. Uh, 
Um, F5. This master of technique over here is gonna... Just gonna let us pass. Okay, so now we have two. Um, okay, I'm just gonna go. Well, that was lucky. And if you are brave, I guess you can try to get these. Are we brave? Let's try to be brave. Because we're performing in front of an audience and we have to look spectacular. Oh my gosh, I almost screwed it up already. It's a good thing you can't hear that. Um, this is going to be harder than I anticipated. <laughs> no run! Yeah! Sweet. I have enough for a shield, most certainly. Okay, I think I can climb onto this wall, but I don't think I need to. I think I need to go. I don't know what I'm waiting for, really. Hey, what is this? Can I check it? No, I can't check it. Oh, oh I remember this one's kind of difficult. Keep saving it. I'm sorry. Sorry for the save scum. Wait, do they go back and forth in a big circle? Big circle. Big circle. Awesome. I didn't even, like, overtly remember, or I should, like, really clearly remember those obstacles in advance, but I kind of remembered the solutions once I saw them. Oh, I can't get these. Oh, hey, I think, yeah, look, Easter egg. I remember reading about that. It's Mario and Peach. Which means that Mario is a fictional character within Hyrule. Or the Mushroom Kingdom is a real place. Uh, somewhere in this same planet. I'm gonna say that those pictures are canon. Let's... Let's talk to Zelda! It's Zelda! Oh my gosh, Zelda! Who? Who are you? How did you get past the guards? No, it's, it's kind of... It's what I do. What's that? Is that... A fairy? Then are you... Are you from the forest? <laughs> You wouldn't happen to have the spiritual stone of the forest, would you? That green and shining stone? God, I've known you for like three seconds and you're asking me for jewelry? That's just... that's... that's... that's not polite. <laughs> just as I thought! I had a dream. In the dream, dark storm clouds were billowing over the land of Hyrule. You can even see those fucking things in the cutscene. But suddenly a ray of light shot out of the forest, parted the clouds, and lit up the ground. The light turned into a figure holding a green and shining stone, followed by a fairy. I know this is a prophecy, that someone would come from the forest. Yes, I thought you might be the one. Oh, I'm sorry. I got carried away with my story and didn't even properly introduce myself. I am Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. What is your name? Nah, uh, I ain't got a name, no one ever bothered to give me one. Sparrow? Strange, it sounds somehow familiar. Okay then, Sparrow. 
I'm going to tell you the secret of the sacred realm that has been passed down by the royal family of Hyrule. Oh boy, story time! Please, keep this a secret from everyone. No. <laughs> Come on, don't be a blabbermouth. Please, keep this a secret from everyone. Uh, fine. If you say so. The legend goes like this. Yeah, it's reading time. Oh, can I get a drink? The three goddesses hid the Triforce containing the power of the gods somewhere in Hyrule. You know, like they usually do. The power to grant the wish of the one who holds the Triforce in his hands. Sentence fragment. If someone with a righteous heart makes a wish, it will lead Hyrule to a golden age of prosperity. Or you could give everybody tits or something like that. If someone with an evil mind has his wish granted, the world will be consumed by evil. That is what has been told. So the ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the Triforce from evil ones. But let me guess, it didn't work. That's right. The Temple of Time is the entrance through which you can enter the sacred realm from our world. But the entrance is sealed with a stone wall called the Door of Time. And in order to open the door, it is said that you need to collect three spiritual stones. And another thing you need is the treasure that the royal family keeps along with this legend. The Ocarina of Time. Okay. Did you understand well the story I just told? Yes, please do not repeat it. That's great. I forgot to tell you. I was spying through this window just now. You cheeky little... The other element from my dream, the dark clouds, I believe, they symbolize that man in there. Will you look through the window at him? Nah, I don't care. Okay, fine. It's really weird that they give you the choice to just be like, no, I don't care about the story. Leave me alone. <laughs> Can you see the man with the evil eyes? No, I don't possess vision. My computer's not working correctly. That is Ganondorf. Totally different from Ganon. I swear, he hails from the desert far to the west. Though he swears allegiance to my father, I am sure he is not sincere. The dark clouds that covered Hyrule in my dream, they must symbolize that man. Eh. Hmm. What happened? Did he see you? Yeah, no, I guess so, whatever. Don't worry. He doesn't have any idea what we're planning yet. Oh, we're planning? Some... What are we... What's... What's happening? I told you, or I told my father about my dream, however, he didn't believe it was a prophecy. Yeah, because it was a dream, but I can sense that man's evil intentions. Maybe you're just judging him by his outward appearance, huh? Maybe he just likes heavy metal, listens to thrash all day. What Ganondorf is after must be nothing less than the Triforce of the Sacred Realm. Maybe he just wants you. I mean, the townsfolk think you're pretty. You must have come to Hyrule to obtain it. And you're like, what, eight, nine? People get married at eleven? That's not much grooming. And he wants to conquer Hyrule. No, the entire world. Sparrow, now we are the only ones who can protect Hyrule. Please. I don't believe you. Please believe me. 
My prophecies have never been wrong. Well, you do live in a castle. Please. Okay, fine, whatever. <laughs> Thank you. Alright. You say so. I'm afraid. I have a feeling that man is going to destroy Hyrule. He has such a terrifying power. But it's fortunate that you have come. We must not let Ganondorf get the Triforce. I will protect the Ocarina of Time with all of my power. He shall not have it. You go find the other two spiritual stones. Let's get the Triforce before Ganondorf does, and then defeat him. One more thing. Take this letter. I'm sure it will be helpful to you. Letter of recommendation. I got her autograph. I'm gonna sell this on the Happy Mask store co-signment or something. We don't have eBay yet. Oh, that guy's gonna... Oh, wait. He's gonna be all... Meh. And I'm gonna be like, Hey, I got a letter. I don't know if I have to equip the letter. I can't use the arena here. That's kind of strange. What's this? Oh, pull it back. I have three of those. Hey, it's the map that I ignore almost all of the time. I got a letter. Wait, how are you here? Link, turn around. Turn around, Link. I am Impa of the Sheikahs. I am responsible for protecting Princess Zelda. Everything is as exactly as the princess foretold. You are a courageous boy. You are heading out on a big, new adventure, aren't you? My role in the princess's dream was to teach a melody to the one from the forest. This is an ancient melody, passed down by the royal family. I have played this song for Princess Zelda as a lullaby ever since she was a baby. There is a mysterious power in these notes. Now listen carefully. I don't know where she's from. She's she's from some fantasy. Don't 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 ask me where she's from. Left up right, left up right, left down really up right, down down right. I always have to do it with the proper timing more fun like that. Wow, I know a song now. That's amazing. Wait, did he just see Princess Zelda behind him? There's Princess Zelda. You learned Zelda's lullaby. I can see Sheik and Zelda in the same shot. The castle's so... If the castle soldiers find you, there will be trouble. Let me lead you out of the castle. I forgot where her... I was, I was going for Russian, and then it was like becoming Austrian, and then like African, and I don't know what the fuck was happening. It was hard to hold on to. I'm not great at a Russian accent. You couldn't tell. You brave lad, we must protect this beautiful land of Hyrule. Take a good look at that mountain. That is Death Mountain, home of the Gorons. They hold the spiritual stone of fire. She's just from some damn... She, she, whatever. At the foot of Death Mountain, you will find my village, Kakariko. That is where I was born and raised. And so everyone there should sound like me if you are at all competent. When you talk to them... Uh... They will probably waste your time, but then you must go up to the mountain. And the song I... I can't... I'm, I'm terrible at this. The song I just taught, she has some mysterious power. Only royal family members are allowed to learn this song. Remember, it will help to prove your connection with the royal family. The princess is waiting for you to return to the castle 
with the stones. All right, we are continuing to come. Oh, we are. You fucking go do it. Bye bye. That was pretty weird, huh? I said I imagine Normie sound Normie. I imagine Navi sounds like Norm Macdonald in my mind. Okay, save it. What's our time? Thirty minutes. Well, uh, okay. Uh, you know, what? let's buy the shield. Even though it's useful to do this, let's just let's just spend the money on the shield because I think there's like fire and stuff, and I, I think it just I think I'm supposed to buy the other shield. Plus, I have all the money, and that's kind of annoying in a way. Like, why does the money max out? That, that's, that's the one thing that I've never understood about this fucking franchise. You should not be able to fill up on money. Money's one of those things that you find space for. You don't just leave money because you're like, oh no, I've got enough. No, you pick it up. You find a space for it. Look at this guy. He's got money shoved all sorts of places. You find space for money. Welcome. Yeah! Buy it. Do -da -da -do. Oh yeah, I don't have to use it all the time. And there's my money. All gone. Bye bye money. Um, so with the remaining time, I could attempt this uh, target practice game, or I could walk over to the other place I'm supposed to go. I think there's an advantage to doing this. So I'll try to get this in eight minutes, and I probably won't. Let's see. Do you want to play a game? It's 20 rupees per play. Yes. Nope. You. Oh my god, I don't have enough. <laughs> you are right. You are absolutely right. How embarrassing. Hello? A dollar? A dollar? Anybody have a dollar? Quit calling. Thank you. Okay, so now with seven minutes and the proper funds. Oh my god, we only have one attempt. That's right. But you want to play a game? It's 20 rupees per play. Okay, this is a game for grown ups. I will play my shooting gallery. Take aim at the targets from the platform over there. So you hit 10 targets, you get 15 shots. So our weapon will be. Are you ready? Go for a perfect score. Good luck. Uh, oh, shit. Shit! Woo! Ah, oh, fuck. Well, we screwed it up. I should be better at this kind of thing by now. No! Uh, missed two of them. I'll let you try one more time for free. This time you gotta do it! If you say so, brah. Number one. Damn it! <laughs> Who says people fold under pressure? God, I missed two of them again. Ah, uh, I missed a bunch of them. Practice hard and come back. Nope, I'm out of money. Ah, uh, we gave it our best shot. 
And let's just make it over to the next place. Except defeat. We gambled. And we lost for now. And yeah, there's a room that's basically full of money up here, but... That fucking game is stressful. Because it's... Aiming is not the easiest thing with that. It's like there's a huge dead zone, and I think I can manually reduce that, but it makes it so hard to just move it a little bit, because it's like, you want to move it, you want to, oh, over here! No, that's not what I wanted to do. But yeah, now we're going to continue, and act like I didn't just waste $20 shooting at rupees and failing publicly. Whee. Something's gonna attack me in a second. If I don't hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hey. Hey. Abby's got some shit to say. What would Saria say if we told her? Oh, what was. What was Abby's voice? What would Saria say if we told her we're going to save Hyrule? I don't know. I don't really care. I don't think about it too much. Those sounds coming from the game or from my cat? Kakariko! Oh yeah, everyone here has like a ambiguously Eastern European accent. Ding dong, ding dong, I'm clock soldier of Kakariko. The current time is 1735. Hello there, son, Zelda's attendant. The great Impa opened this village to the common people. We have only a small population now, but someday this place will be as lively as Hyrule Castle Town. Oh yes, it will. Climb up the stairs at the north end of the village to find the trail that leads up Death Mountain. But you'll need the king's permission to actually go up the mountain. I got close and then I drifted away. It became like a South American accent. I'm shit at this. But that's why we practice. Okay. That's that's almost 40 minutes. Let's... <laughs> I am the boss of the carpenters. The Impa hired to improve this village and make it into a true city. But young men these days don't have any ambition. Do you know what I mean, kid? My workers are just running aimlessly around the village. And they're not making any progress at all. Even my own son doesn't have a job and he just wanders around all day. They're all worthless, I tell you. Yeah. Silver Age. It's not our fault. Our parents were competent people. They were busy being asked to do competent things. All day long, we are working on many construction projects in the village. It's going to take a while before everything is done. Our boss works us very hard. Alrighty. Yeah, I imagine it's going to take... Uh, probably my entire childhood is what I would bet. Uh, I think I need to, like, pick up a chicken lie somewhere important or something. Hey, now I'm not completely impoverished. And there's a guy up there. Yay, six dollars. I don't think I can find this. Okay, well... That seems like as good of a stopping point as any. We are here in the village, and uh, we'll explore the village, you know, in a minute, or a week, or whatever it is. However time works out for you between when I started this and when I pick it up again. 